I'm going to do something with my solar power system that most people don't do. But if they have solar power, they really should. It's very sunny, the batteries were fairly low, they're getting charged up at a rapid rate. 7,500 watts over usage coming in. Most people don't check all their electrical connections to make sure everything's still good and tight, and if you don't, it can create heat, and sometimes too much heat. Now I've done all that several times, but I'm gonna go a step further and actually use a thermal camera. Now if I was using this thermal camera for reports or anything scientific I would have calibrated it it's not calibrated all I'm doing is getting it to show me spots that it says are warmer than others so far checking everything it looks really good I'm kind of just looking at all the connections maybe spots where there are screws it's also important to note that when a surface is reflective like glass or shiny metal it looks like there's a hot spot but that's just a reflection probably off this light over here look at those heat sinks though that's pretty cool and I would say even though they are reflective the one in the middle is not currently on because it's in float mode so even though those heat sinks are somewhat reflective it's still picking up these two lower wires are going to the inverter and as you can see what we're really doing is bringing power in from the charge controllers and the temperature obviously reflects that already made sure all these connections are tightened down and i think we're in good shape 